Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into an intriguing piece of NBA history, and that's when Scottie Pippen was dead set on leaving the Chicago Bulls for the LA Clippers during the 94-95 season. This story is filled with drama, trade offers, and relentless determination of one of the greatest players to ever live. So let's get into it. Pippen, a six-time champion with the Chicago Bulls, had a career filled with highs and lows. While many remember the Bulls' attempt to trade Pippen for Sean Kemp in 94, there was another significant moment when Pippen was keen on joining the LA Clippers before the 1995 trade deadline. After Michael Jordan retired to pursue a baseball career, Pippen stepped up as the Bulls' leader. During the 94-95 season, he led the team in points, rebounds, assists and steals, guiding them toward a clear playoff berth. Despite the Bulls having the second best defensive rating under coach Phil Jackson, Pippen still wasn't happy. He openly expressed his desire to leave Chicago and find a new team. In Jack Silverstein's book titled How the Goat Was Built, quote Pippen saying he was counting down the days until he could leave the Chicago Bulls. He hoped other teams were considering him and said, I am showcasing myself out there. Well, the Clippers were one of many teams very interested in acquiring Pippen. They proposed a deal involving their next two first round draft picks and the right to exchange picks the following two seasons. This would have given the Clippers the second overall pick in the 1995 draft and their top pick in 1996. However, Pippen's relationship with Ron Harper, who informed him about the Clippers' management issues and lackluster fan base, made him hesitant after that. The Clippers wanted Pippen's assurance, but he grew more reluctant as the deadline approached. Ultimately, the deal fell through. In a wild turn of events, just eight days after the trade talks collapsed, Michael Jordan announced his return to the Bulls. This highlighted how irreplaceable Pippen was to the team, even though Jordan had been away. The Bulls lost to the Magic in the second round of the playoffs that season, but they went on to achieve another three-peat in the following years. Looking back now, it's fascinating to think about how the Bulls and NBA history might have changed if Pippen had been traded to the Clippers. Would the Bulls have been as successful without him? Would the Clippers have risen to prominence with Pippen leading the way? I guess it's another classic NBA case of what could have been. That's all for today's deep dive into NBA history. What do you think would have happened if Pippen joined the Clippers? Let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more upcoming videos and NBA content. This is Basketball Network. My name is Damien Peters. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.